solid state cinema provides uh, extremely relevant pictures or even movies in the case of molecular dynamics or protein emotions and uh, this is uh, the basis of uh, our capacity to alter uh, uh, interfere with a biological process which is what uh, drug development uh, is about. Most of the uh, uh, pharmaceutical uh, de development in pharmaceutical research is driven by X-ray crystallography for samples which can be crystallized, samples which cannot, which are not accessible to X-ray crystallography cannot benefit of this, uh, of this uh, structural insight provided by X-rays. X-ray typically uh, pictures uh, or captures a single picture of a molecule, is a snapshot of a molecule in a very well um, defined fixed conformation. Often in the biological molecule, biological molecules explore a range of different, different conformations which are exchanging over time scales, which are either very rapid in the nanoseconds, sub-nanoseconds, or more, um, more, more slow, up to, well, up to milliseconds, or even uh, slow movements uh, over seconds. NMR, and in particular cell, solid state NMR, with uh, a number of developments to which our, this laboratory has also contributed, can probe, can, uh, probe these kind of movements over the different time scales. What is now possible with the avail availability of the highest magnetic fields and the fastest magic angle probes is the possibility of uh, uh, exploiting the detection of protons. So protons are the nuclei which have the highest geromagnetic ratio and typically are inaccessible by solid state NMR because uh, just because of this very large geomagnetic ratio they are subject to large dipolar couplings which make their voice sort of uh, an understandable in the solid state NMR experiment. Now what we have uh, demonstrated is that uh, by spinning the sample very fast in a high magnetic field it's possible to obtain uh, spectra which are both resolved and sensitive. Therefore, uh, we can uh, extract the, the, the voice and, and extract and interpret the voice of this, uh, of this nuclei in a very sharp and straightforward fashion. And uh, we have shown that this can be transformed uh, with the uh, sophisticated uh, uh, spectral analysis tools uh, developed here in the center, uh, can be transformed into a structure of the protein.